Hello, my friends! You arrived just at the right moment! I just finished an amazing story about a boy that acquires supernatural powers. Although he's at my age, he can do many things that I cannot. He can fly, he has superhuman strength, evil men chase him, and he always manages to get away, even if he gets hurt. I wonder, could he be able to walk with crunches? I can! Two days ago, I got injured on my knee. Do you want to hear what happened? During a class break, my friends were playing basketball and I was the referee. Then Costas asked me to join them. That day, I missed taking my therapy and I knew that I was not supposed to play basketball. But I got carried away. As we were playing, I fell down and I injured my knee. Although there was no bleeding, I stopped playing immediately. Then, after a while, I felt a tingling sensation inside my joint, which started to swell and ache. Hold on, do you know what a joint is? I guess not, so I'd better explain. Our legs, arms, fingers and knees have joints. Generally, all moving body parts where two bones meet are called joints. Look how the knee joints work. In order to prevent bones from rubbing against each other, a cover spreads around them called a synovial membrane that produces a fluid which helps the bones move easier. The cartilage has inside many small blood vessels. When I fell down, these vessels broke and blood was released inside my joint. Because I have hemophilia, bleeding took a lot of time to stop. This is the reason why I felt a tingling sensation inside my knee. Then I remembered that this is a sign of bleeding inside my joint. Then my knee started to swell and I was in pain. That's how I realized that my joint was bleeding. But I was not scared. I called immediately my teacher, who put ice and pressure on my knee to stop the bleeding. And because I had to take my treatment immediately, the principal called my mom and drove me to my house in his car. I rested my leg on pillows and took my treatment right away. I was afraid that my mom would be mad at me and I was very sad. But she explained that she was proud of me because I immediately recognized the symptoms of bleeding. I was very happy. Now you know why I'm laying on the bed. I'm not supposed to put pressure on my leg until it heals. Fortunately, I'm not bored. These days my friends visit me and we play video games, I play board games with my sister, I do my art lessons at home, me and Lila carried on with the vampire comic and I still go regularly for swimming, since swimming helps my knee to heal sooner. Today I will return to school, but for a few days during the breaks I will have to stay alone in the classroom. Every day, one of you, will you keep me company during the break? Thank you very much! I'm so lucky to have such good friends!